So, this is my residence area. Awfully dreary, isn't it? Does that mean my heart's dried up? Resonance area connection is stable. You should have an easy time. <laughs> Good. Thanks, Amy. Let's get to it, then. It sure is scary being inside your own mind, though. Who knows what monsters are in here? Hmm. Is this one of those memory nodes I've been hearing about? Yes, I've confirmed it on my end, too. Please start removing it, Ricardo. Gotcha. Okay, now please be something we can chuckle at. From this day forth, you're all members of the Great Gleipnir. Delegate Ricardo Sforza, step forward. I swear that I shall ever endeavor to fight for the future of humanity. Ah, uh, starting there, are we? Give me a break. This is too embarrassing. And I was considered pretty good back then. <laughs> Laughable, huh? I heard you were handpicked for this large-scale operation too, Ricardo. <laughs> Let's do it. We'll lead the way to victory. We'll be Gleipnir's elite. <laughs> Still wet behind the ears. And that ambition! <laughs> it was a few years before the Calamity when Gleipnir planned a large-scale origami hunt. But everything went haywire, and the operation failed. Second defensive line broken! Origami swarm incoming! Abort mission! We get all of <laughs> Are they all dead? Will anyone save me? R Ricardo! Help me! Can't stop the bleeding! I don't want to die! Especially not in front of a kid like you. I think we're done, Amy. Can we go home? Understood. Initiating disconnection sequence. Sorry for showing you something that heavy all of a sudden. I used to be a Gleipnir zealot, fully believing we were defending humanity. Can you believe it? But in the end, I couldn't accomplish anything. Not even dying properly. Like you saw, Gleipnir's plan failed because of an unexpected origami encounter. I was the only person there who survived. The experience broke something inside of me. I left Gleipnir soon afterward. And that's pretty much the story. 
I appreciate it, but you don't need to console me. If I'd kept fighting until reinforcements came and rescued me, I could still face myself. But... My comrades needed help, and I turned my back on them. I didn't even try to fight. That's why I'm comfortably standing here today. I'm a coward who's not worth defending. Uh, sorry, I've said way too much. I wish you wouldn't look at me like that. This old man's memories are all like this. Boring stories, I'll just waste your time. If you're still willing to lend an ear, fine. Just don't let it get to you, okay? Resonance area connection established. Good to be with you again. Let's get moving. So, what do we see this time? Oh, that was pretty quick. Let's make this place look presentable. No slacking, guys. Sure takes me back. Hey, you know satellite bases? Little surface settlements that were around before the Calamity? After leaving Gleipnir, I worked to defend a satellite base on the frontier. It was a comfortable place. Not many origami attacks, the people were all kind. I liked it. In any case, I thought it was perfect for someone like me. So, you're the ones I was told would be staying at the base for research, right? Nice to meet you. I appreciate the hospitality. I'm Hilda Enriquez, and this is... Ricardo Sforza. Is that you? Didn't expect to meet you again in a place like this, Warner Gatlin. Oh? You're already acquainted? He was a god eater at Gleipnir. A fine one, but... Let's not bore the lady. And I'll show you both around. The owner and Werner, still students at the time, came to the base one day. Meeting the Governor General's son after all that was... painful. Underground base. Yes, the idea is to avoid origami attacks altogether. It'd be safer than satellite bases. If we can make it a reality, we'll be able to flawlessly support God Eaters on the front lines. So we're going around to each satellite base to spread information and collect opinions. We want to build a place where everyone can be safe and happy. A place we can call a utopia. <laughs> a utopia, huh? I like it. Gotta dream big. I'm on board. That dream still moves me. It's almost too pure. Memory notes confirmed clear. I don't hear any voices on my end. Are you okay? We're fine. Prepare for our return as usual. Right away. Initiating disconnection sequence. Thanks again, friend. Let's go home, shall we?
Hilda Enriquez and Warner Gatlin. As you know, they were together as students who shared the same dream. The focus of their studies was building an underground base impervious to origami attacks. Sounds pretty familiar, doesn't it? Yep. Their research turned into reality in the form of ports and kept a lot of people safe. I mean, they laid out the theoretical framework, but Gleipnir did the actual construction. It's amazing. The dream they shared is still holding life together in the Ashlands. Their idea was just too big. All I could do was smile and nod when they talked. But now, I live to defend the dream they talked about back then. Life sure is strange. Ah, oh, brother. I'm rambling yet again. It's my only real flaw. Let's keep at it, okay? Being with you gives me the feeling I can accomplish something. Origami off the bat again. Not a great start. It's a hostile memory node. Use your god arcs on it. Roger. Well, we're in for a rougher ride this time. message from Clayton here. Apparently Argami are on the move everywhere. They'll be here any minute. What did you say? I'm sure you were just a kid, but you remember the calamity, right? Ash storms everywhere. All at once. Aragami habitat suddenly changing. The satellite base I protected was in the middle of the predicted route for an Aragami stampede. There's no way anyone could have stopped them. No! Oh, damn it! Our bastards keep coming! Ricardo, you saved me. Stop dawdling, Warner! Get Hilda out of here now! That's crazy! We can't just leave you here. Listen to me! Which one of us is more important to you? Defending this place is my duty. I'll do it this time. No, I refuse. I can't leave a friend behind. Warner! Ricardo! Get on the trailer! We're leaving! Ah! Damn it! Let go! Let go, Warner! Please! Just let it go! I'm not done. I, I can fight. Let me defend this place. That day changed the lives of everyone who survived. Ricardo, connection unstable. Initiating disconnection sequence.
You, uh, really keep seeing me at my most pathetic, don't you? Sorry, I wish I could show you memories that'd be more motivating for a young person. But, uh, yeah, I'm not exactly cut out to be a hero. <laughs> Come on, laugh. Well, yeah, you wrote out the calamity and kept on surviving too, after all. Anyway, the satellite base was destroyed, and Warner and the owner saved me. I barely escaped with my life. After that, uh, I don't really remember much. But since the Governor General's son, Warner, was there, rescue teams from Gleipnir came running. And the owner and Warner? The light was gone from the eyes of those once happy dreamers. Somehow I knew that the spark would never return to them. After that... Well, you know the rest of their stories, don't you? That day, the lives of the civilians at the base weren't all I failed to protect. I know I put too much of a burden on myself. But... I just can't help thinking that way. Promise you won't tell the owner about this. Let's leave the past in the past. Well, that was another gloomy tale. I think I'll refresh myself with some serious cleaning. Why not give me a hand? I'll cook whatever you like for dinner if you join me.